So driveway bill after last night's shenanigans got pretty freaking saucy, but we're really not allowed here anymore. Like, we really went out with a bang. <laughs> Alright, so here's a long night ahead of us. Grail Lock yeah. City. A broken car. My car's a little broken. No, tin snips. <gasps> what do you want to use? Knife? Can you shape it? No, just cut it. No! Just cut it! Oh no. No! God, please, no! No! What are you doing? So, we are headed to Netco and their car's already broke. We're only at Thompson Speedway, which is 10 minutes away. It's not broke. This is cringe. This is cringe. We need to do it. Otherwise, bumper's destroyed. It was free. Destroyed. Yeah, but it actually looks nasty. And his muffler is broken. I don't know if we're gonna try and fix Sleepy's car, but my bumper's caught. Hopefully we don't rub on the way up, but. I think I can do. You can tighten the hose clamps. Yeah, tighten it. Just met up with the prop boys, what's up? Gang, whole lot of gang shit. <laughs> uh, your boy needs some big cable ties because my exhaust is about this high off the ground. And he scrapes on every little and pebble. every little pebble I scrape on. All right, so we're all heading out now. Time to make the two hour trip to Nedco. We're filling up now. I gotta find somewhere to pee because this place sucks and the bathroom's only before nine. But we got Sleepy, Nick, Christian, Dante, and then Brendan. This ride sucks. The bumps in Worcester are the worst, and we have like an hour and a half left. Would you just spray it in the air? So drift prep's never over, huh? It's the night before. No, it's the morning of. Morning of at Walmart. Prop it up on a carriage. <laughs> oh, big facts, big facts. I would definitely do that. Kid's got the street heat merch. Oh my god. Here we go. Paint it up. And you can see all the stripes. Now we head to the track. It was a rough night of sleeping in Ryan's bed. And we made it.
on sleeping. <laughs> like it was running but it wasn't running like you could hear the motor like lobing still but the car was not moving he's like what and he goes to start it boom boom <laughs> So, another Neko event, another motor. Oh. It just stopped coming here, honestly. Like, we were just sitting in Yuki's car, and it's just like, bro, I heard it. It would like hit my heart. I was like, I looked at Jake, and I was like, what was that? And he goes, what was what? And I was like, Sleepy's car is on fire. We felt that in Yuki's car. Yeah. We're sitting in <laughs> there. So, driveway bill after last night's shenanigans got pretty freaking saucy, but we're really not allowed here anymore. Like, we really went out with a bang. <laughs> Let you know. Give us a little recap. Come on, Sleepy. I don't know. I came off the track. It didn't sound like it was running. I tried, tried to start it, and then it just exploded. Flames went everywhere. Now it's just a big melted fucking lop of shit.
see was Adrian's car blowing up, but pack up now. Everything's loading up besides Adrian's car, and I gotta pack my car. Come visit the sleep over here. What's up, sleepy? What's up with this thing? Pack up the RV right now. The RV? <laughs> Yo, give me a blue. Here's a yellow. I don't want the yellow. He's gonna try and stuff his car with all this stuff. I'm gonna take a Gatorade, and then we'll be on the road. I mean, if you disconnect your ECU, you can. We need to wash anyways. But, we're just gonna pack up quick so we can get on the road because this is gonna be a terrible ride home. This is Sleepy's ride home right here, so have fun in there.